Are you ready to learn some grammar with Bonner, Caitlin, Brianna, and Rebecca? First we'll, first, we'll explain verb voices. Active voice is when the subject of the sentence performs the action. I sir, Caitlin's notebook. Passive voice is when the subject of the sentence receives the action. An example is, the notebook was thrown by Brianna. The blade of grass is plucked by Caitlin. The first mood we'll talk about is indicative mood. Indicative mood indicates a state of fact or opinion. An example is, the notebook was thrown. Conditional mood indicates a state that will cause something else to happen. This uses might, could, and would. For example, this notebook might tear. We have this adjunctive mood. This is when the mood becomes contrary to the fact, as if wishing to be still. An example would be, I wish we were on a hat. Next mood is imperative, which expresses a command or request. An example is pick up that notebook. Brianna, come here now. What mood is that? That is imperative mood because it expresses a command or a request. Which verb, mood, which verb mood is this? Will we finish the project on time? That is interrogative mood. Good job. Which verb mood is this? I wish the project wasn't due on Thursday. That is a subjunctive mood. Good job. Which verb mood is this? The Clemson Tigers are the best team in college football. That is the indicative mood. Good job! What voice is this in? We are going to watch a movie tonight. That is in the active voice. Good job! Now that you're done learning grammar with Bonner, Brianna, Rebecca, and Kaylin, you're ready for our two unit test next week.